Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Chris Burns Outdoors. Today I thought I would do a uh, quick rundown on what I do for cold weather, how I layer up um, when I'm out on the water fishing. It can get, it can be a miserable day out there, guys, if you're not dressed properly. So, um, so I like to kind of layer up, and I've got a certain uh, certain routine that I've kind of that I kind of do, and I've been doing this for years, being living up north and working outside a lot of my life and hunting and fishing. So um, I just thought I'd give you a quick rundown on, on what I use and, and see if maybe it helps any of you guys out. So first off, I always start with a base layer. Um, and I like to go with this Marywell, Marywell. It's a new, um, it's a new, kind of a new, newer product, I guess. But um, back in the day, they just called it long underwear. But they've got pretty technical over the years and um, but I'll be honest with you, this stuff is great. Uh, it's, it feels really good on your skin. Um, this is a midweight, so they've got a, a lightweight, midweight, and heavyweight. So the midweight, it's like 250 grams. Um, and I got this right on Amazon. I paid 60 bucks for the top. It's got kind of a, a hook right here where you can hang it to help dry. Uh, but it keeps that sweat off your body. So I kind of start off with that. Um, and then of course I've got the base, base layers to kind of go with that same thing made by Mary wool, um, which is a synthetic wool of some sort. It's just basically, uh, this here is, uh, let's see if I can see the tag exactly what it is. It doesn't really kind of explain it, but anyway, you guys can search a little bit about it, but it's a really popular, um, product. So I kind of start that, start off with that, the base and the bottoms. Then what I'll do is I'll just layer up with the next layer with uh, just a tackle warehouse shirt, you know, nothing special with this. Five bucks when you spend over a certain amount on tackle warehouse, so I have several of these. <laughs> but, um, and then what I try to do is I always try and tuck these in, guys. I like to create a seal around my body um, as I'm layering up. So that's kind of the, the next thing that I'll do. Um, and then what I'd like to do is once that's all on, I go with a wool sock. Uh, basically this is also Mary wool. Um, it's a really, it's not super heavy, but, um, I'll put this sock on and then what I'll do is I'll create a seal over top of the base layer pants. And then from there, um, I'll go with a heavy duty wool sweater and uh, this one here is an ll bean um, sweater this is wool and uh, this one here in particular is the uh, the waterfall sweater and ll bean has this up and it's pretty heavy it's got this collar here that i can zip up and down if i get too hot um, but man does this thing keep the heat in pretty good so i kind of put that next um, and then from there, I'll go, depending on how, how bad it is, um, I'll just put my Reaper on. Got my heavy duty Reaper. And like I, I've done a review on this before, guys, I'm not going to go too in depth with the Reaper because you can go look at one of my other videos and I kind of talk about it. But this is an awesome shirt here or a sweatshirt, um, keeps the rain off you somewhat, but, um, but that'll, that'll kind of go over top of that. Now, if it's, and, and there's good movement in all this, guys, too. That's important. You're out there casting all day. Um, the worst thing you can do is be constricted. And so so that kind of works pretty good for me. And then I also, a lot of times, I use this for hiking a lot. But this is just a, a down jacket, super light. Um, this is an REI. I bought this over at REI. The thing folds up into nothing. I mean, you can see how tight that gets. But... It keeps the heat in big time. And so if it's not too bad, a lot of times I'll leave these two out and I'll just put this on over top of uh, my Tackle Warehouse shirt. And that works really well. So then next, I will go with my rain suit. Now this here is made by Drake. Um, awesome, awesome product. This is the uh, Guided Series Ultralight. Um, it's not a winter 
rain suit it's it's you can use it for both seasons but it sure does keep the wind out um and that's really what this is for and it, it really really warm guys so it's got magnetic top up here you can just see how that snaps and it also has a pocket put your phone in there and it has both of those pockets on both sides plenty of storage um it also has this big pocket here which i like a lot of times if i'm fishing i'll put my baits and stuff in there um or whatever snacks whatever i want to get real quick real you know fast fast accessible is right there and then it also has two um two pockets on the side here and those are fleece but when we're on the water i'll give you a better review of that so you guys can kind of see and that's my made by drake uh drake performance fishing guided ultra light um rain suit so i'll put that on with my bibs um which these, these are awesome too guys this here zips all the way up on both sides i could just zip this down on both sides and peel it right off so it's got uh it's got a good pocket up here on this side another pocket on this side uh hand warming pockets up here on the top um plus i got another big pocket down here super easy to zip up heavy duty straps um you know drake's known for their uh, for duck hunting and you know when you duck hunt you're usually in cold cold weather and their product is is pretty awesome so this suit here probably goes for around 500 bucks total that's the top and the bottom and you can get that at uh tackle warehouse i think amazon's even got it they got different colors um, but like i said once we're on the water here shortly i'll i'll give you a better rundown on that the other thing i like too on that it's got a big 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 d hook too for my kill switch so um shoes boots i go with a keen boot um super light uh you put that keen boot in there with the wool socks my feet stay warm all day waterproof um it's got this rubber right here so it bends real easy uh love these love these boots guys and they're and they're super worn and they're made by keen um so that's that if it's really cold which coming up in january here getting ready for the chickamauga tournament i'll put the heated vest on first uh this is made by numa um it's got uh heat down the back you can kind of see where it's heated here in the back um and it's also got heat here in the front and then you just kind of got your battery that goes in this pocket here little cord you plug your battery in um and i've got two batteries i can run this uh on medium um two batteries gets me through all day one battery probably runs i don't know maybe maybe about four and a half hours guys five hours heats right up it it'll actually go up to um 130 degrees so so then the next big thing is hands you know I, that's been a challenge for me i i don't like to fish with gloves on you know you're using light line you're always clicking the bell back or you know bait caster you're pushing a button gloves are always a problem for me um so i keep it simple i just use these old cheap gloves here i think you can get them at how you get them at 7-eleven tractor supply sells them you can get a bag of 12 i think for 10 bucks and then all i do guys i just cut the fingers out um so i i'll cut my fingers out of those and then basically i'm able to grab the line do anything i want uh with, with without that and then what i'll do is i'll put these in a ziploc bag i'll keep five or six pair in a boat throughout the day you know it doesn't take much to get these wet guys uh you know you definitely need more than one pair but for for 12 pair for 10 bucks you can't beat it uh, what i'll do they're real easy take off i can pull them off with one hand if i want to switch line or do whatever they're just super simple gloves but they keep your hands pretty warm and you don't even need to cut the fingers out on this hand you could just use this hand and cut your fingers out you know and you're able to click your bail back or tie your tie up your lures whatever you want to do so that's kind of what i do as i'm up on the deck fishing and then what i'll do when i'm running i just get a good mitten 
Um, this is made by Boss Tackle Warehouse. I think you can get these for 20 bucks. And basically these are my running gloves. Put them mittens on. It's got a, this has actually got a spot for a hand warmer right here. So those morning runs at takeoff on tournament morning and you're trying to run to your spot, everybody knows it's done. It gets super, super cold. So, um, so that's kind of what I do. Easy to pull off. Not hard, pop them off. I need to change my screen or do whatever. Um, it's really accessible. So, like I said, gloves is always a challenge. This is my system. This is kind of what I use. Um, it works for me. I like it. I'm really excited about this rain suit. I'm gonna, like I said, we'll do a really good review out on the water. So, all right, guys, we'll see you out in the water. We're gonna head now. Let's see if we can't catch a couple of fish, and I'll run through this cold weather gear once again. But um, we'll have it on, and I'll kind of kind of show you the bulkiness of it what it looks like and and then we'll do a good review on the on the drake uh, high performance um ultra guide fishing fishing suit so okay we'll talk to you here soon guys thanks hey guys here we are on the water uh it's not too cold today actually it's actually pretty nice uh it's supposed to get up to 60 degrees but this morning uh we were around 42 degrees but just thought I would go back with the cold weather gear, kind of show you, um, show you the rain suit. This is, uh, you know, the Drake's perform performance fishing guided series ultralight rain suit. Uh, man, super comfortable. It's got knee pads right here, guys. Um, it's got a zipper that zips all the way down on both sides. It's got a magnetic area right here. Put your phone in there, and that just goes. It just. It's all magnetic for quick release. It also has a zipper here, so you can put stuff in there. Same thing on this side. Then it's got these huge pockets, guys. You can put all kinds of baits, snacks, whatever you want in there. Um, yeah, super nice. Kind of see the back of it. Um, really good hood with the face shield up top. You can cinch these down on the sides. Um, just, just a really nice suit, uh, real happy with it. Um, it's also got the big hooks on the side for your kill switch. And then guys, the bibs. So here you got a big pocket right here for your, for storage or whatever you want, big pocket here. Um, also got zip pockets here, zip pockets here. On the side here guys, it's got fleece lined hand warmer so you can put your hands in there um, really nice buckles pretty got pretty pretty stout easy to adjust pick it up adjust it to what you want um, yeah man can't complain it's super nice it's also got uh, two side fleece pockets here on the coat so just thought I'd give you guys a rundown of this you can see how I've got my my down shirt up underneath this and I put my um, Mary Wool, um, Mary Wool Long Johns or base layers, you want to call them, uh, up underneath. Uh, got the Keen boots on. Nothing's bulky about it. But like I said, guys, it's pretty warm today, so I didn't really go crazy. I didn't have to put my Waterfall LL Bean sweater on that wool sweater. Kind of tell I got my gloves on here. These cinch down really good around the gloves. Same thing with the pants. They cinch really good. Um, the knee pads come out guys if you want it a little bit lighter this thing is super super light I think the coat is at 20 ounces and the uh, the bibs are at 20 28 ounces I think is what it is guys so um, yeah you can't complain there man I mean that's uh, for for a suit that light and in this comfortable um, so anyway that's what it looks like out here on the water with all my warm weather gear. I'm comfortable all day. Don't have to worry about elements. If it rains, I'm, I'm good. I've also got my uh, uh, my Reaper AFCO hoodie in the back storage. If I get a little bit colder, I can throw that on or later on maybe I can take the coat off, put the Reaper on. But what I've got on here is good for all day. I mean, um, so anyway, guys, this is the... Uh, the Drake uh, Guided Series Ultralight uh, Rain Suit. It's got three layer in here. Um, 
just real quick, just want to show you the inside. When I say three three layers, built three layers, it don't have three layers of, of insulation. And you can use this for cold weather. You can use it for um, uh, for the summertime. It's light enough for that. And that's kind of what I was looking for. Um, you know, they had the AFCO uh, Hydronaut. I was looking at that, guys, but it's super heavy. And it's probably great, great rain suit and cold weather gear. But if you layer up like I showed you, you'll have no problem wearing something like this. You can fish all day. You can shred stuff off as you go. With that Hydronaut, it's not, you can't shred it, guys. It's heavy. Um, not putting that, that down, but just, just, uh, just my thoughts on it. There again, I'm not sponsored by any of these guys. I just thought I'd do a quick video just to kind of give you guys an idea of um, of kind of what I wear. And uh, anyway, take it or leave it. Um, anyway, y'all have a great day. Get out on the water. Get some kids out there. Take them fishing. It's uh, this time of year is awesome. I'm hoping to catch some big fish here today. Wow.